Welcome everyone, I'm Commander Mad Mace, and today we are playing the Sleep Experiment. It's uh, supposedly based on a true story that I've heard before, where these individuals were subjected to days and days of, well, staying awake, and all kinds of gruesome stimuli, and it sounds absolutely horrendous. Uh, I did notice when I launched it, there was this uh, warning screen, so I wanted to leave this up for y'all to read first before I started. All right, let's get into it. I like that loading screen. In the year 1940, in a secret laboratory deep within the Soviet Union, a group of ambitious researchers embarked on an experiment that was meant to change the course of history. Their goal was to create invincible soldiers, individuals capable of staying awake and fighting in the most challenging conditions. To achieve this, they devised a dangerous and controversial experiment, subjecting human subjects to extreme sleep deprivation. Many considered the sleep experiment a failure, and a cautionary tale about how far science should not go in pursuit of progress. But I believe the experiment was a success, and you will find out why. I don't know if I want to find out. Oof. Oof. <laughs> oh my god. Um, okay, hold on everybody. Can we crank this up? I don't want to use my entire desk to turn my camera. There we go. That's, that's better. You know, it's becoming a common theme, it seems, lately, that these indie-developed games look so good. And this is just a demo. I mean, these indie devs are, I mean, graphic-wise alone and how just realistic everything works, are really putting a lot of AAA companies to shame. Is that a bomb? Why, why, why is Q, C4? I don't, I don't know, I probably shouldn't be pressing random buttons on that, but let's see. Uh, 115, denied. If you know what 115 is, it should be Apocalypse. It wouldn't be that, right? Okay. Why? Why is there C4 just on the wall at a very beginning? Okay. Uh, is that part of the stimuli? Is that not actually a... Uh... Is that not actually a, uh, a real piece of C4? Oh, it's locked. No. Eh. I don't like you. You just pretended you're asleep. Are you the one that actually beat on the door? What's going on here? Use. 
Oh, nine two one oh. There's gonna be something behind me, ain't there? But yeah. I don't like the humming. You can stop that right now, ma ma'am. That was a staircase there, right? Alrighty. Ma'am, I'm not trying to take a peek at you. Ma'am. Don't like it. Nope. Don't like it. Don't like it. Oh, I can sprint. Okay. Ma'am, I'm tired to bother your uh, activities. Yeah, why is it soft touch cream foundation? Okay. It, well, <laughs> oh, my eyes. Do I have cybernetic eyes? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck is that? Wait, hold on. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I don't like you. New backup. I don't like where this game is going. Sorry, I know I backtrack a lot. I don't know why I always try to make sure I get everything. Make sure I get y'all all the scares. Where'd her stuff go? Did she move out? Am I a ghost? Rotate. Core. Zoom. Hmm. I don't like it when there's audio and nothing actually here. Oh, look at the little doggy. I'm sorry I touched your dog. Oh, I got him. He's freaking adorable. Hey. 
What was that code? It was... What was it? 9210? Yeah, 92... What? I do not want to do it. Oh, sorry. 9210, okay. Wait, is this going to disarm it or blow it up? Ma'am, I'm sorry. I don't really have training for this kind of job. Where'd my mouse go? Oh, there it is. Nine, eight, nine, two, ten. Nine, two, ten. What did I do? Are you gonna blow up? <laughs> Ma'am, I think we need to leave. I think that thing is gonna go boom. Now what? What do? What do I do, puppy? What do I do? days without sleeping <sighs> that buddy I'm bored already and these books are shit I can't wait for this damn experiment to end yeah well we got 30 days what you got over there <laughs> nice clock Let's go with some food. I'm not dealing with you right now. I guess I did it wrong. I've killed them all. But that was my mission. To destroy that building. I had no choice. I believe that what I'm experiencing now is the atonement for my sins. Anyway, what day is it since the experiment started? The fourth day? The fifth day? Use me? I don't know if the radio was supposed to do that. That was weird. What's that? Well, hmm. I'm gonna tell me anything else. See how it is. How about you, buddy. Want to talk? Freaking 
radio. The peoples. Just a house within a building. It's always nice. Ooh. What kind of wine is that? Come on, let's have a little drink of poke. I'm down for it. Mean loot. Okay. didn't know we were going to be fighting Pyramid Head. What? Okay. I was like, read this. I don't know if that makes it worse or better. Unknown serial killer haunts a city. Detectives struggle to unveil their dark entity. A wave of brutal and enigmatic murders send panic through the community. Our once serene and peaceful city has been plunged into a whirlwind of fear and terror with the emergence of an unknown serial killer. Sounds like Pyramid Head. In a series of gruesome and sinister events, this remorseless murder has left behind a trail of innocent victims and detectives are battling to unveil their dark entity and bring justice to this hellish realm of crime. Th Is this inspired by Silent Hill or was Silent Hill inspired by this? Because that's what it sounds like. Without a distinct crime pattern and no apparent connection between the victims, authorities face an adversary highly skilled at covering their tracks. All the murders have been committed in, with chilling precision and a complete lack of empathy, deepening the mystery shrouding this nefarious string of events. It's an indescribable nightmare, said one terrified local. We don't know who will be next victim or what this monster's next move will be. It's like living in a horror movie. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. I mean, just look at the picture. Ugh. Why so aggressive? What's this? I don't see you. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. I'm sorry, my friends. I can barely pronounce my own name, and it's stupid simple. Oh no. Oh no. They're going to pop up right uh, right in front. I know it. Oh. Oof. Oh no. Oh no. If this, if this is what no sleep for 30 day causes, I won no part of it. No part of it. What's in this mirror? Me. Oh, is it? Shh. What exactly is it showing me?
Nice picture. Oh! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm sorry I touched your mirror. What am I supposed to be doing with these mirrors? Is this supposed to be telling me like uh hidden objects like can I go back and oh, oh. old chest okay so I need a code for that okay that there I'm funky going on here okay so this is, shows another room yeah that room okay what do I need to look for in it Looks like there's a secret door, okay. I assume that's what it means. So let's just go around to that door. There it is. What was, what was the mirror in here? What was that for then? room did this show probably going to be the room I'm about to go into assume it's going to be either the picture on the wall or that I'm going to need Maybe even the clock. I'll leave it there. Okay. Let's see. <sighs> Crazy mix of hallucinate, like hallucinations. Hey, those aren't on the wall. Ugh. Hello. Where did this door come from? Oh, what is that? I don't like the little red smiley face there. It's our secret, don't tell anyone. That is, oh, 381. That's a really cool picture, but that is creepy. I touched your mirror. You gonna come after me again? Oh, this is back in that original room. Okay. Ah, that door. Hello? You gonna come after me again, guy? Open up your box. Hee <laughs> hee! Got it, buddy. 
Now what? Ooh. I got a key. The only item I got. I bet it's to this weird freaking door. How did I know? Oh, I don't like that. I do not like this at all. A new victim has been found. The counter discovered dead bodies has escalated to nine. The authorities are clueless about the identity of the murderer. At any given moment, there could be more victims. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you knew who the murderer was, right? Why did you decide to hold on to this secret? Was it due to fear or doubt? Your apathy resulted in the deaths of numerous innocent individuals. I just you got here. You resulted all this with a mere report to the police. You opted to let the murderer walk free, implicating you in his heinous crimes. You chose to be the executioner of those people. I just signed up for an experiment. What are you talking about? Was it? I just wanted money. That door is gone, bro. Murderer? I didn't do nothing. God, I've been awake too long. Sleep experiment. We extend our gratitude for your participation in the demo of the sleep experiment. And yeah, I gotta say this. I like where this is going. I definitely want to see more. This was... That is trippy. And if, if this is stuff you can actually experience when you're that sleep deprived. 30 days. Like, that is insane. And if y'all haven't seen the actual sleep experiment that happened in real life or heard about it, it go look it up. It is uh, all horrible what these people went through. But, but yes, uh, Team Claws Dev, I'd love to see more. I can't wait for the full release. I'll definitely play it then. All right, I'll see y'all in the next video.